Rianne Evans, 12 times World Snooker Champion. Matt Pryor, highest break, 35. Yeah, every now and again you say to someone, I always miss the green or I always miss the blue, pink, or whatever. but it's just it's just practice. In snooker, everything's repetitive. You need to keep practicing and practicing and practicing. I started playing when I was about eight years old, so nearly 30 years now. And have you ever managed to clear the colours before? No, I've never done them, even when I started on the yellow. You are sweating quite a bit. Yeah, I am. I think it's terror sweat. <laughs> So we just have a look at your basics, so you haven't got to hit a ball yet, we'll just see how you get down to the shot. Okay. Okay. Right, everything's pretty good, a good bridge. You could bring your hand further up the queue a little bit, so it's, yeah, that's a little bit better. And your legs a little bit wider. That's it. And you, st you start closer to the white ball, not your hand, just the queue. When I say closer to the queue, the, not your hand, the queue's... No, a bit closer where you are, but that's it. That's how you start. <laughs> <laughs> so the main three shots that we use in snooker are called a stun shot where you stop it still, right. and the top shot where you put top on the ball and it on the white and it goes forward, and then bottom of the ball is backspin and it comes backwards. Okay. So we'll do one of each. So uh, stun shot first. It's up to you. Which you prefer? Um, can I play it and then tell you which one? <laughs> We always start in the middle first, that's okay. where sort of aim. So it's literally just below centre, aim at the cue ball where you want to hit, and you make sure you hit right in that same place when you fake it. That's pretty good. Come back a little bit, but I'll let you off. <laughs> top? Yeah, so make sure you aim right at the top of the cue ball, everything the same as before, and just make sure you push the cue through to accelerate the ball through. Well, you had a bit of stun on that one because you dipped as you go down. Oh, really? Yeah, so as you're going d through, you're going like that with the cue rather than just pushing it forward. Okay. Okay. That was better. Mm. See, see the stop start on the top yeah, then? Yeah, yeah, then yeah. there we aim at the bottom of the cue ball. Everything the same as what you've just done. Start a little bit closer to the cue ball. I told you you'd be good at screw shots. That was perfect screw shot. Thank you. Lovely and straight. Falling back in love with this sport. <laughs> <laughs> He's not sweating as much. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for that. Um. <laughs> Are you ready to try the colour? Yes, please. Are you sure? Yes, I am, yeah. So, all right, I'm going to try and demonstrate how to do it now. Okay, good luck. I need it. Well done. I even hit the blue really bad then. Okay, so you've just seen me clear the colours, so do you reckon you could give it a go now? I will give it a go. I don't know if I'll be able to do it as well as you. Yeah, I'm more confident, like relatively speaking, yeah. Lovely. And same again, stun or a bit of screw? Little, little screw shot on this one, yeah. Off the cushion. Oh dear. <laughs> so now you just concentrate on the pot. Just make sure the, the pot on the brown. That's a great shot. You, you like playing off the cushion. You? Yes, I know, yeah. Again, you just need to make sure the blue. This is nice and easy. That's a great shot. <laughs> What's going on? So obviously I know, I know I've lost position and I've never cleared the colours before and it's usually because if I get as far as the blue and I pop the blue then I lose position on the pink and then I miss the pink. So was you thinking about that just? 
Yeah, I, I mean, <laughs> this is, I've been here so many times before and it's, I feel like I'm having a flashback to an unhappy nightmare. You just got to concentrate on the pot. Forget about the white ball, just concentrate on fighting the pink. Okay. Slow. hard so now you're going to pot the green in there and try and screw back just about level with my hand there so you stay on the ground to go in there okay i'll give it a go okay do you remember everything yeah i forgot my name <laughs> So again, you've played that really well. You haven't got to do a lot with the cue ball again. So we're just playing like a, just below a stun shot here with enough power just to come just off level with the blue okay. into this middle pocket. Okay. You can handle the pressure. <laughs> <laughs> What? See, the perfect line just wasn't quite hard enough. And look at Tables are a bit slow, aren't they, I think? <laughs> <laughs> See, you're a true snooker player, really, because you're blaming everything for yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Might just make it. Oh, you put too much top spin on. <laughs> you still got a shot, though. Got a shot. Still got a shot. Again, all you need to do is concentrate on the pot, because the natural line will get you on the black anyway. <gasps> oh, he likes the cushion. <laughs> and again, all you've got to do is make sure of the pot. <gasps> no! <laughs> yes! <laughs> <laughs> it's probably one of the happiest moments of my life, I think, so... I don't think I've ever done that before. You've played some really hard shots there as well. Thank you. And some bad ones. <laughs> and some good ones. <laughs>